this tattered old rope? You don't need it. There's a nice strong piece of rope later in the game. Oh, well, thanks for that. That's, that's a nice, that's, that works, okay. All right, let's go this way. I can't remember exactly the, re the uh, order I need to do things, so we'll figure it out. All right, here's the uh, paralysis pod things. Let's save here, just in case they decide to change something. Like, do you really want to do that? Yes. <laughs> yes, I do. The spores are light blue and bulb-shaped. They seem to be loosely attached to the ground. Mine. You take possession <laughs> of right one of the pants. spores, being careful not to mistakenly break it open. I can't remember if I actually get points for making myself pass out from them, but whatever. We'll see if we'll, we'll play with it later. Hello, spore monster. Hello, little dude. Dude! You can see a little guy across the clearing picking some sort of berries from a bush. Yes, I know. We've you already startled seen him. the odd little pink dude, causing him to bolt into the underbrush. Hi. Hi, dude. All right. This looks like the brains of the operation. Yeah. Alright, let's see how this works. So apparently they must have changed something because everyone seems to be going crazy. The vines extend from the pulsating plant, almost like they're looking for something. I know what they're looking for. My tongue. Let's not and so Okay. Alright, let's see don't if we... Whoop. This thing is kind of heavy. I don't think I can throw it that far. He says while shoving Wimp, it up his ass. I guess you better find some other way to make use of the ordinance. Crap. Alright, let's... Carefully... Her way over. This is much easier with point and click. All right, we'll kill him in a second. Let me see if I make it through here first on my first try. This would make me happy. Uh oh. Uh, good. No, that doesn't work. No, no, oh, that's awful. Ah, oh. oh my. Okay, all right. It's not that way. Okay. Let's see. Well, let's just see if I can get close enough to him. And maybe the uh, unstable ordinance was the way to go, but I just need to be closer to him. It thing, whatever. Let's, let's go up here where it's closer. All right, unstable ordinance in your face. This thing is kind. Wimp. Oh, wimp indeed. Okay. Hmm. Uh, can I look it from here? Let's not. Let's. No, I can't. All right. Hmm. I've seen stupid things before, but that was really pointless. Oh. Oh. Let's see. Oh well, let's see what happens if I cross it. No, 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 no. Oh my. Oh my. Oh. 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 Oh my god! Oh. Good. You've succeeded in establishing contact with one of this planet's life forms. That was unexpected. The thing exploded, taking you on a one way trip to that great garden in the sky. If only it didn't look like a maze, you'd probably be able to think a bit more outside the box. That was... That was kind of awesome. Okay, alright, so let's do what the obvious thing is. We'll sling it. Nothing happened. No, we can't. Oh, I thought that would be the no obvious thing to do. Okay. Hmm. Nothing Alright, I can't do that. Nothing Huh. What's this thing? This is an order form. Oh, the order form. Huh. Well, let's think a little bit simpler here. This thing is kind of heavy. Well. Her. 
do with it? I may not have anything I need. Okay, all right. Well, let's come back to it. Maybe I'm overthinking things as I like to do. I do like how it sort of turns down the uh, speed for me. Look through the multicolored grass. All right, well, let me take a look. Uh, you know, the multicolored grass is way over there, and I can't get to that without doing the... getting through this little thing, so whatevs. We'll come back to it in a second. Let's go ahead and drop off my order for You him, seem so to I... have kicked one of the uh, strange little spores. Over here. Oh, down, oh, down I go. Your kick caused some spores Three darts to is spray too fine much. into the air. As a result, you are paralyzed from head to toe, unable to move a oh, single muscle. Blast. Huh. Well, uh, I guess I'll be stuck here for a while. Oh, I'm fine. Fortunately, the paralysis wears off. Well, I don't get a point for it. That sucks. All right, let's go up and around. We'll drop off the thing so I can get myself into trouble later on with Arnoid. That's important. After we lick the mailbox, of course. Though the intergalactic post office slogan is, in fact, if you don't like it, bite me, you doubt they meant it literally. I don't want to bite, I want to lick it. So let's uh, let's put our order form in there. You drop the order form into the box. The mailbox hums Instant and buzzes gratification. for a while. Then an object of some sort drops into the tray at the base of the box. The machine goes silent. The tray, which is actually a small indentation in the lower part of the machine, is currently bearing what looks to be a whistle. You take the whistle. Obviously. Eh. Sweet. I now have a Le'Veon Terror Beast whistle. The whistle is usual looking. It's probably one of those boring uh, explanations of anything I've ever seen, but he's absolutely right. I can't lick my inventory, guys. I'm sorry. I tried. I really did. It's the dude! He's doing his old duty dance. It's a cheetar. A cheetar centaur. Whoa, it's Nah, only kidding. It looks dangerous, though. Is that music play the entire time? Oh god, that's awful. Alright, well let's see what happens. Let me get attacked by the, the, the Cedar Chentar thing. Yeah. You know you like it. Maybe I can make it, he thought optimistically. Let's go. I can do it. I can do it. I won't get caught. Here we go. Look at me. Look, I'm gonna make it. Look, look, I'm gonna make it. Look, look watch me, watch me, watch me. The swamp monster attacks you. Oh no! I wanted to see it. You're dead. Crap, no, no, that's no good. That's no good. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Beware of the sacrilege. Uh oh. This isn't good. Alright, I broke it. Can't do anything. Okay, well hang on. I gotta restart. <laughs> I broke the game. I'm sorry. Oh, that's right. Yeah, they did tell me that there was version 1.1 of this thing coming out, but the, eh, that's okay. That's, that, that's, that's a small thing. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Roses is back. Hi, Roses. We're about to get eaten by a tentacle monster. Do you want to watch? Watch us. Watch. Here we go. Oh, the that wasn't monster it. attacks you with its slimy tentacles. You struggle in vain to free yourself. 
<laughs> You're dead. <laughs> God, that sound. All right, let's never do that again. That was totally not worth it. Oh, Jesus. Oh, make that stop. It's like someone rubbing a fucking balloon. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's continue on. There must be something. Uh, the foliage here is... Okay, no. Can't pass the foliage. Can't pass the foliage. No, I haven't done the berry thing yet because I have not yet found a way to get past the new brain monster. Tentacle monster thing. So, let's see. There must be something else. Can I do anything on this guy? Leave with? the guard alone. Uh, you have ever Oh, got all that. I took the rope. Let's see. Well, maybe these guys want my unstable ordinance. Nothing. As Spock would say, Spock would say. You okay, no, they don't want that. Um, one of my parallel paralysis. It doesn't things. work. Hey, don't look at me. If it were up to me, you'd be able to fart a rainbow that takes you to the end of the game, so I could get out of here. But no, we're all stuck here to the bitter end. I didn't think about taking the rabbit out of the hole. Okay, all right. Let's see. Oh, I didn't know how deep you a hole it was. You reach into okay. the deep dark hole and pull out the bunny. How the hell did you do that? That hole is obviously longer than oh, your Oh, so the game admits its leap of logic. I guess realism isn't a concern here in the future. Ah. I have a dead bunny in my pants next to the unstable ordinance. It's the bloody carcass of the adorable bunny-like creature you found. Alright, well let me see. Um, Do we want to give this to the mushrooms or should we give it to... The, uh, the, the, mush, the, uh, brain monster thing. Let's see. Let's, let's start with the mushrooms here. Let's see if that works. Let's save, just in case this is a bad idea. I've... No, nope. okay. So it's definitely for the brain monster. Brain monster! Coming! Fluffy, fluffy, bun, bun! No! Fluffy, fluffy, bun, bun! Okay, let's see, um, chances are the bunny would just sort of be an appetizer for me, so let's sabotage the bunny. Uh, ooh. You shove the unstable <laughs> ordinance up a readily available orifice of the dead creature. This takes me back You're to, a uh, man, there's a similar Roger. puzzle in, uh, in, um, uh, what was it? Rex Nebula in the Cosmic Gender Banner. That's what this reminds me of in an odd way. Alright, fling the bunny. You place the rabbit carcass on the sticky vine plant. Eat it. Eat it. Nom. Eat the dead exploded bunny. Nom, nom. Nothing like a good explosion to brighten up your day. Alright. And you thought you'd have to navigate the maze like vines. Har har har, I kinda tried and stuff. Har har, that made me feel like an idiot. Berries! You snagged some of the odoriferous red berries. Odoriferous. I solicitously, I solicitously grabbed the odoriferous berries. Fnark. Okay. Save. I didn't spell that right, but whatever, fight me. Is there a chorus in this? What the hell? Wait a minute, listen to the music. That's beautiful. Wow. Up to the music. That's nice. Okay, let's see. I don't have anything that's gem-like, but I can put the berries in my mouth. The strange red berries pack a very pungent aroma. I know it's a synth chorus, but still, it's admi it's it's appreciated. 
<laughs> Phoenix has a dragon con. Nice. Okay, um, I think we've done everything we need to do. So let's go ahead and cross the, uh, the, uh, the swamp of bad sound effects. Very quickly, because this sound is awful. You rub the berries all over your... Okay, yeah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Come on, we don't want to hear this anymore. Yeah. Let's go, 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 go. The swamp monster attacks you with its slimy tentacles. You distinctly hear the sounds of aquatic gagging and Yeah, yeah, that's great. Go. Oh, look around this. Oh, that's right. There's the whole diving thing. I've stepped into a deeper area of the swamp. You take a deep breath, filling your lungs to near bursting, and head for the depths below. Oh, I didn't save. Let's hope I'm a good swimmer. Uh, there we go. There it is. There it is. The gem. The gem. That's all. BT519, welcome. Steven Alexander, yes, thank you very much. The game is absolutely fantastic so far. How do I get out of this? There it is. Jim, you are destined for my mouth. That's a pill you just can't swallow. You take the glowing gem. Let's do it. Oh, I, I just can't wait. Jim, in my mouth with you. Go, go, go. You don't need to use the gem at the moment. Oh. Um, BT519, as we go, I mean, feel free to please uh, interject any kind of commentary that you want. I love, uh, yeah, this, because this will be for, this is for posterity. So, by all means. Once again, you wisely take in a load of air and head below. Whoop. Pa. You have gotten out of the deep spot and are back on your soggy feet. Oh. I only have one complaint about the game so far, BT, and it's this, this balloon rubbing sound effect. <laughs> Make it stop. Make it stop. Away. Oh, oh there we go. Phew. Alright. Here we go. Okay, let's save here. Oh, why is, why, hey, why is, oh, God, it's stuck. That was weird. Okay. All right, so let's, let's get this thing over. This tree is dead and seems to be free of the slick secretions as some of the others generate. You begin to shimmy your way up the snag. Crack! Oh, <laughs> holy log jams, Batman! You almost bit the big one. Excellent. Okay. Um, I remember. Oh wait, I need the rope first. Okay, I can't do anything here just yet. So let's let's continue. Let's continue. There it is. That's my vine. That's the vine. That vine belongs hands to me. Off, you. No, hands, mine. Hands. Oh, fine. All right, have it your way. I'm gonna look at this stuff, though. It's a large bank of fungus. Look like bones. It really looks like I can go up this way. Nope. Okay. Hey! Yikes! You have been snared. Snarled. Suspended above Suspended. the ground, you are unable to move freely. <laughs> uh, quick, lick, lick the rope! After a while, the cerebral fireworks begin. Capillaries begin to burst under the strain. You pass out. Oh. Crap. Oh, again, down I go. Time passes. And then, some more time passes. While unconscious, you have the strangest of dreams. Oh, sweet. Dream sequence. <laughs> you say that your name is Larry. 
You are wearing <laughs> oh, I'm going to lick everything in Leisure Suit Larry. Apparently made of fully synthetic materials and proven to generate large amounts of static electricity. Can I play? Oh, I can't play it. That, this is a nice touch. Nice touch. Props. While prowling a locale known as the Land of the Lounge Lizards, you spend your time badgering women of the area to participate in bizarre mating rituals uh, such as... Just then, consciousness begins to creep in. No, I want to stay here. There's so much naga hide here. Oh, God, it's a predator. Your head begins to clear and you realize that you have been imprisoned. Your captor appears to be that large oaf sitting near the fire. Lick him! Alright, I've been instructed to save my game and just to see, or sort of see what happens. Okay, so let's chill out here for a while. Let's take a look around. These creatures are genetically bred, rigorously trained to subdue the most threatening creatures in the universe. And he has captured you. He looks a little embarrassed about it. I'm gonna give you such a lick. From the looks of that fire, he plans to go the other way. Well, I'm gonna lick your fire out. Are you trying to extinguish the fire with your spittle? Who are you, Smokey the Bear? Leave it alone. Uh, hi. My name's Roger. Roger Wilco. <sighs> That's cool looking. I'm not done. Oh crap. I think I've, I've tested this patience. The hunter stands and takes a long look in your direction. His face, though strange in its own right, bears an expression one might see on a freak show patron. Hi, sir. What are you going to do with me? You've come into lick range, my friend. You are in trouble. Oh, crap. I can't lick you with my larynx stud. Oh, yeah. The hunter decided that it's a perfect day for a barbecue. As he slowly turns you over the fire, you begin to turn a beautiful golden brown. Death follows at an agonizingly long distance. <laughs> oh, wow, that is... You guys are... You guys are awful. <laughs> oh, but I love you. Okay. Um, now I kind of forgot how what I'm supposed to do here. Um, yeah, that's right. Eh. Upon impact with the ground, the spore opens and spews its dust into the air. The hunter falls to the ground, paralyzed. But it's anything like my experience. I only stay unconscious for about five seconds, so I gotta move. The lock on the door is crude looking, but effective. The rust would prevent anything but the cur- Oh, shit. Um... Hmm. Put gem in mouth! You don't need to use- Oh. <laughs> Damn it. That always works. Um... You can't read. Oh, boy. Um... You poke this- You make a heroic attempt at bending the branches that make up your cage. And then you- hero Oh, wait a minute. Wait a second. I wait. I fucked up. Hang on. Wait, 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 wait. All right, come on over. Uh, that's just that's just awesome. Okay, come on over. There's a uh, obviously been some mistake here. Can you let me out of this cage? Sure. Rah, 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 rah. Hunter is fit. Would you like to put my gem in your mouth? Here. Outlook unclear. <laughs> nice. Upon impact with the ground, the spore opens and spews its dust into the air. Nice. Everything you have belongs to me now. Reach through the bars and take possession of the key. Nice. Mine. Nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You slip the key into the lock and give it a turn. Hooray! Rope is mine. You grab the rope. 
Alright, let's see. I'm gonna get this bone. You move to pick it up, but it is both brittle and slimy. Even if it could survive the trip to your inventory, you'd wish that it hadn't. Two wrongs don't make a right. <laughs> Besides, he obviously got the idea first. Lick skeleton. Mmm, the taste has faint undertones of Soylent Grey. <laughs> Lick everything. Mmm, tastes like oregano, with just a hint of rotting flesh. Oh man, apparently that's what he got here. Okay, before he wakes up. Okay, bye. Eh, oh. It's got kind of this Asian feel to this uh, area. It's sort of like a Vietnamese type of thing. I like it. You are at the edge of a forest. I don't want to look at it. I want to see if I can lick it from here. I'm not that hungry. Uh oh, lick the staircase. You sure do like living on the edge. Maybe the staircase being here in the original. Let's, let's see. Down we go. Okay, come on. You feel at the edge of the ledge. Nope, no secret pathway. Face it, you aren't Harrison Ford, and this sure as heck isn't Indiana Jones. Hmm. I know. I'll lick the hell out of these no stairs. No to the fifth power cubed. Cube. That's that's it. That's it. That's it. That's a hint. That is. The Rubik's cube will solve this. Eh. Keep trying that. Oh. Hmm. Everything must be sniffed, eh? Using the very tip of your nose, you go <laughs> up the stairs until you notice a crack. Peering closely. You realize it's a mini keyboard. <laughs> Now's the time for the password. Yep, the password. If you don't know what you need a password for, you're probably not going to get it. Oh, man. Press when you're done. Oh, dear God. Um... That's not the correct password. You should read more Henry Wadsworth Longfellow. <whistles> All right. Oh, you guys are getting devious here. All right. Well, before you tell us, BT, um, is this um, is this something that we can actually discover for ourselves, or uh, is this something that only you super secret developers know? I'm curious. What's this? The grass here is trimmed and feels a bit rough. Ooh, so it's hints on forums. Secret developer's puzzle. Ooh. Is that a monkey on the bar? Hey, bitch, how's life? Not bad, not bad. Oh, this is the best remix of the theme ever. That was one strange experience. Okay, and now back to our regularly scheduled program. Um, let's see, was it, uh, I can't remember if you used the rope on the stump, or I think it was the middle one to use it on, not that one, because I think I just ran up ripping that right out. Yeah, because it's a dead tree, that's a bad idea, so we'll do it here. Gripping firmly with your legs, you tie the rope to the middle of a makeshift bridge. Whoop. Oops. Okay, hey, I sh the swing o -matic. nice. Oh, crap, okay. All right, so let's... Well, that doesn't work. I will die here, yes. You release your grip on the rope. This has a negative effect on your resistance to the urging of gravity. Oh, did I hit the jump button by mistake? <laughs> oh, no. Ah, crap. <laughs> oh, well, that's not too far. Come on. Come play with me. The hunter is fake. Play with us, Jinxie. Don't forget a King Charlie. <laughs> Upon impact with... There we go. Got you see. There we go. In we go. Whoops. You slip. 
grab the rope. You grab the rope 